Feathers and Hair, What Animals Wear, written by Jennifer Ward and illustrated by Ying Ying Song. Some animals wear feathers. Some animals wear hair. Some animals wear prickly spines and roam without a care. Some animals wear armor. Some wear a traveling shell. Some wear tough and pointy horns that serve them very well. Some animals wear slippery skin. Some animals wear scales. Some wear skin quite thick, not thin, from their noses to their tails. Some animals wear extra fur. Some animals dress plain. Some animals wear wild hair that scientists call a mane. Some animals wear color. And change their color too. But only one wears clothes from head to toes. That animal is you. Meet the animals in order of appearance. Animals are able to tolerate extreme temperatures, migrate long distances, fend off predators, protect themselves, attract one another, and handle life outdoors without an option of choosing what to wear. At first glance, a wild animal's appearance may seem simple, but there is an amazing science behind every part of its physique. Birds are the only animals that have feathers. Feathers come in a variety of sizes, colors, and shapes, and each type has a specific purpose depending on the species of bird and where it lives. Bristle feathers, stiff feathers on a bird's head that may protect the eyes and face. Contour feathers, feathers that provide shape and color to the bird. Down feathers, soft and fluffy feathers that trap air insulating the bird. Flight feathers, feathers found on wings and tails. A monkey is a mammal. Mammals wear different types of hair depending on the species. Bristles, firm hairs that may be short, medium, or long. Guard hairs, an outer layer of hair that protects an undercoat. Undercoat, short, dense, and fine hair that keeps the body warm or cool. Whiskers, sensitive hair on the face that provide an animal with information about its surrounding. Porcupines are mammal. They may wear spine, quills, or bristles. In some species, the quills can detach and spear a predator. The armadillo is a mammal. It has a little bit of hair, but is mostly covered with overlapping bands of hardened skin that help protect it from predators' claws or teeth. The tortoise is a reptile. It wears a permanent shell, a collection of bony plates that are fused together and grow continuously throughout its life. Its body is covered in scales. Scales on a reptile are actually overlapping layers of skin. The hermit crab, a crustacean, must find another animal's discarded shell to wear in order to protect its soft, exposed stomach. As its body grows larger, it must periodically discard its shell and find a bigger one. A rhinoceros is a mammal and may have one or two horn-like growths on its nose. The horns are made of thickly matted hair, are permanent, and never stop growing. A gazelle is a mammal with horns, which are permanent and never shed. Both male and female gazelles have horns, but the horns of the female are often shorter. If two male gazelles fight, they may lock horns in an effort to throw each other down. Frogs are amphibians and mostly live in moist places or near water. Their skin is soft and smooth, thanks to a gland that produces slippery mucus to help keep it from drying out. Fish breathe underwater with gills. Most species have bodies covered with scales, which usually grow in overlapping plates. The study of fish scales is called squamatology. Elephants are mammals known as pachyderms. Pachy means thick and derm meaning skin. 
an elephant skin may be up to one inch thick on parts of its body. Polar bears are mammals that wear one of the thickest fur coats in the animal kingdom. Their fur protects them from the cold and wet Arctic environment. Although a polar bear appears white, the hair on its body is transparent and has a hollow core. The structure reflects and scatters all light waves producing the color white. Owls are birds, so they are covered with feathers. Although many bird species are colorful, some species such as owls have coloring that help them blend in with the surroundings where they live. Blending in helps them to stay hidden from predators and also allows them to get close to prey. A lion is a mammal. Male lions have long bristles around their head and neck called a mane. Scientists are not sure what function the mane serves, but they believe it may help the lion appear stronger and healthier, features that may attract a mate and frighten off rivals. The chameleon, a reptile, has clear outer skin. Underneath its skin are layers of tissue that reflect light and produce vibrant colors, allowing it to blend in or communicate emotions such as excitement or fright. The octopus, a mollusk, is able to change the color of its skin in a flash. In addition, its muscles can create lumps, ridges, and spikes to help it change shape or match the texture of its surrounding. The seahorse is a fish. Because of its shape, it doesn't swim well. Instead, it wraps its tail around corals or sea grasses, anchoring it to one area. It then will change color to blend in with the background and hide from predators. Humans are mammals, and we wear skin and hair every day, just like the mammals in this book. Skin covers the entire human body. It keeps our insights in, help us sense our environment via nerve endings, and protects us from bumps, bruises, and falls. We have hair follicles, spots where hair grows, everywhere on our body except on the palms of our hands, the soles of our feet, and our lips.